<clears throat> Hello. I was just double checking the controls because this is, it, it really is just a little old game. It came with a README and the controls are pretty simple. You know, WASD, enter, and the space bar. It's a, I mean, this it's just a cute little non-violent game, so we don't need much more than moving around. It, my nose feels a little nasally, but today, you know, we're just gonna kick back and relax with this. <clears throat> Got me a, well, mostly full cup of coffee, so let's kick it off. Shiny. A strange little statue seems to react to you. Three of us remain. Friendly bug. I've seen some ball stone statues of these woods. They give off a weird vibe. Heck if I know what they're for though. I'm just a beetle. Wabika, the Grove of Solace. Village to the east, oak to the south, spring to the north, general store just ahead. This was very, was clearly written by someone else. Of course. You gotta get your advertising bucks in. What? The ground looks cracked up here. Hmm. So maybe I need a shovel? So. Acorns. <laughs> Traveler from another land, you are free to explore as you please, but know that the keys to obtaining what you seek are located in the heart of Wabaka, the green forest. Oh, it's a hill. I mean, let me just... Let me just... <laughs> the little creature looks at you with sad, watery eyes. Give it something? Um, yes. What do I have? Uh, I don't think it will want a ration. I suppose I probably will have to come back. Ooh. You obtained a cool shell. Cool. Let me bump this up a little bit. I know the audio is not coming in through very loud. This game doesn't seem extremely loud, so. It is a cute little adventure game that I happened upon. Ooh, shiny. Neat. I found an acorn. It's very cute. So this, so this is made by actually one of the people from Face Punch slash Knockout that uh, put his his or her name in the title Binin, Binin. I I usually print, like in my head I pronounce it Binin, but it might be Binin. But this is all this person's art, and this is like a project that they really you know really put a lot of effort into. Ooh, can I pick the plate? Uh, one second, let me blow my nose real quick. Thank you, so kind. For some reason, my nose was <clears throat> been a little stuffy today. I don't know why. Ooh, look at that.
I figured you'd like this as a little surprise. Because I knew I know you like cute things. And I know you were expecting room more last week, but I I saw this and I'm just like, you know what? Christmas, holiday week, you know. Something cute. <laughs> Shopkeeper. Howdy there, stranger. Some wood crackles in the this iron stove. It keeps this shop nice and toasty. Why are you... What do you mean? So you, have you missed my streams or something? Because normally... You're usually here on Tuesdays. Some green tea that's been put out for customers. Drink some? Oh, you're here. Like, as in you're actually fully able to pay attention. Yes, I would like some tea. Mmm. It's warm. Excellent. It's full of some strange vegetables. They're weirdly shaped, but smell nice and fresh. Hello. Fancy lady. Hmm. These veggies are nice and fresh. Cool. You know, I was looking at the garden outside and I saw something weird in the dirt. I would have picked it up, but I'm not the type to get my claws dirty. Ooh. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> I appreciate, or sorry, I appreciate that you like the loot, but maybe you could play a little less, please. Sure thing, bud. <laughs> it was cute. Ooh, freshly baked bread. Ooh, it smells really tasty. Okay, what's up? Hi. Oh, welcome to Waka Wabika, stranger. I'm looking for something in particular. Oh. Is that so? Interesting. Gotta admit, I don't know much about that sort of thing. But tell you what, try visiting my friend up northeast. He runs a little bookstore. I bet you anything, he's got some old books on what you're looking for. Oh, and here's a map of Wabaka. This should help you out. Good luck. Come again soon. Various strange items fill this shelf. It looks like equipment for travelers. No, Wabika. I know, I want to say Wakiba for some reason. But Wabika. Wabika? Wobika. So the cat said there was something interesting in the dirt. The ground is soft here. Plant something. Um, do I have anything to plant? I could plant an acorn. Darn. Hello. The strange little statue seems to react to you. Two of us remain. Well, hello, little frog. The little creature looks at you with sad, watery eyes. Give it something? I don't, I don't know if I have anything to give them yet. I've just got here. Communal garden. Plant what you want. We won't judge. Somebody planted a rock in here. I mean, I guess I won't judge them either. It's only fair. Ooh, a nut. You obtained an acorn. Yeah, I don't know why my sinus is like all mucked up today. It's really weird. Hello, bug. You know, even if you talk to someone once, they might have more to say later. It's always a good idea to check back on your friends on occasion. Since I'm a beetle, I'm full of wisdom. Mm -hmm. Would you say you're a, uh, a fly on the wall in many situations? Ha, ha, ha. Funny. Hello. Ooh. A strange little statue reacts. One of us. One of us. Remains. Well, hello. Paul Stranger. That outfit. You're from the West too, aren't you? You did well to leave that place. It gets worse there every day. Take my advice. Never go back. 
Sinister. Ooh, Cod I see Codsworth. Hello there. My name is Codsworth. Please enjoy my selection of books. Also, the artifact on my table is quite interesting, in my opinion. Books. You open up a flower-stained book and take a look inside. It's a recipe for apple cookies. They look soft and moist and sweet, and you feel your stomach growl. <laughs> you open an old-looking tome and take a look inside. In this land of Wabaka, there exists a legendary item that represents hope. It has the power to bring civilizations back from despair. However, only those who both truly understand this land and truly need this item will be able to obtain it. It lies dormant within the shrine, waiting for the worthy one who would claim it for their own. You open a fancy looking book. Ooh, you can take a look inside. Wabaka is ruled over by a guardian deity. They are swift to remove dark-hearted intruders from our land. But just as swift to welcome travelers whose intentions are pure. Take note, those who enter, your actions are being judged. Fancy. Ooh. This seat is too high for you to get up. <laughs> Darn. I'm too short. Ooh. Something is written here, but it's in a language you don't understand. Can you clarify, Cosworth? Oh, I see you read the book about the shrine. Interesting stuff, huh? I can't remember how to get there, though. That's that's a shame. We'll figure it out. You already said this. One second, bud. Uh, you got anything else to say? <laughs> Never go back, West. Only a fool would. I'm lucky I managed to escape. Wabaka is far gentler place. Okay, well I gotta find a shrine. Almost crack. Hmm, you are a good student. Here's an acorn. You were handed an acorn. Cool. To die of a beetle, you must love hearing my wisdom. Beetles are full of wisdom. As a beetle, I am especially full of wisdom. Oh, ha ha ha, buddy. Let's see if I can buy anything. Howdy again, stranger. I don't have anything to sell right now, but feel free to look around. And be sure to check back soon. I get new stuff in stock pretty often. Okay. So, we're in the center, right at that little crossroad. So if I keep heading to the right, there's a town. It's not every day I get to have a game that lets me actually drink my coffee and play at the same time. Look at the little stuffed person! Patchwork doll. Hey, you want to see something cool? Oh, God. Ta-da! Seriously, though, this really, really hurts. Uh, see how I was running in the forest when my hair got caught in the tree on the branch? Well, you see what happened. Say, do you suppose you could help out with the tailor? I wanted to see her get this fixed up. Or, uh, I wanted to see her to get this fixed up, but she's got problems, too. Something about missing children? I'd hope, head over and help, and... By myself, but eh. if I take any unnecessary steps, I'm pretty sure this thing is falling right off. 
And you don't really want me to lose my head. <laughs> Help. Water fills the bottom of the well. You can't see any entrances to nefarious places, which is good. <laughs> there are always things hiding in the well, though. Oop. A popular gathering spot for birds. Or at least it would be if you hadn't scared them off. You cad. Bruh. Hello? Hello, tall person. Man, I am really itching for a cup of smooth, tasty coffee. But the cafe isn't even open up yet. Man, what a pain. Damn shame, dude. I got my coffee already. Hello, Taylor. Grub mom. Oh, think the commie. Someone came. Ooh. Home sweet home is knitted under this blanket. Your everyday average potted plant doing the best it can. <laughs> What's up? Please, you must help my poor babies. Not long ago, they heard the townsfolk talking about how a traveler had arrived. So they ran out west to go see, and they haven't returned since. They must have gotten lost. I want nothing more to go look for them myself, but as you see, I've begun pupating and now I can't move. I feel wretched. What kind of awful mother can't help her children? Oh, I, I, I can sniff one in real life. When they're afraid, they usually bury themselves under a birch tree. It's their favorite kind, do you see? If you could return them here, you would make this awful mother so happy. Oh, look at that dog. Do you pet the dog? Uh, yes. Weh, weh. I think this dog is uh, a little, it might be, I don't know if it's great value. <laughs> In all your life, you've never seen, never before seen a creature so blissfully content. Uh... The door is locked. Through the windows you can see a lot of musical instruments. It's covered in different colors of paint. Hello! Talk to precocious kid. Whoa! Who are you? I've never seen you before! You smell weird! Hi! Everyone else is sleeping upstairs. I'm so bored. Hope they wake up soon. Lots of freshly chopped veggies. They smell strong, but pleasant. This wood stove radiates quite a lot of heat. You decide touching it would be a bad idea. Good point. Neat. Found an acorn. These blocks bring a splash of color to this otherwise empty corner. The interior design here is stunning. I agree. You see some recipe books on the shelf. They look well used. Alright, so I need to go help the grub mom, and I gotta find her kids, so I probably need... Ooh, found an acorn. Hell yeah. Does that mean I can... Aww. So yeah, I need like a shovel or something, because I need to dig them out. I guess I need to dig them out from underneath that birch tree that I saw.
Howdy again, stranger. Got any shovels? Yeah, yeah, no. Alright. So... So maybe I can dig them up with... Just dig them up with my hands. I don't think it was... Ground looks cracked up here. Um, I'm not sure. So let's just look around and see what we find. Hello. I wish I knew more about those little statues, but it's a miracle I could even speak. After all, I'm just a beetle. Yes. I didn't talk to you a second time. You know, there are hidden paths all through this forest. As a beetle, I know this well. Sometimes following the trail isn't enough. Be adventurous, my little friend. Ooh, what's up? Adventurous girl. Man, I wish I could get up that cliff behind us and see what's up there. But I can't climb up. It's too high. It's gotta be we get up there, right? I just know it. Oop. Ground looks cracked up here. Hello, frog. I don't think I have anything for you yet. There are words engraved on this stone. Flowers born of seasons four must grow in these woods before. You can walk this water's path to see the gods' cold, stony wrath. One more time. Flowers born of seasons four. So, the four, what would the, the fourth season would probably be like winter? Unless if, you know, this game has different seasons, then that's a little different, but we'll figure that out. Um, can't rub my face into the wall here. Nope. Alright, youngster, sorry about that. I can't help you out quite yet. I gotta, I gotta do more adventure. See if I can go up the side of. Nope, that's blocked off. Let's see if I can't find a path. Actually, well, let's go inspect the beach. Now that I... Because <laughs> I didn't want to diss the game too much. Alright, what's up? Why are you staring at this little chicken? Intense statue. Little thing sounds sad. Little thing missing something. Me not like little things sound sad. It make me sad. Hmm. So, ooh, hello. Passionate artist. Uh, what? What do you want? I have no time for little people in funny clothes. I am frustrated. In the past, beautiful tall flowers bloomed all around Wabaka. Now there are none, none at all. I thought the beach would be a good change of pace, but even the sea does not inspire me. What am I to do without my muse? Are you still here? Leave me in my sorrow, interloper. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Just, just, just. Ooh. Oh, it's gonna be a big crap. Hello? Oh, shit. Hi. Greetings, tiny one. Hi. You speak to the Fred King. 
Unfortunately, we live in dark times. Three of my subjects are without shells to wear. It is a most horrid fate for a friend to be without a shell. It cannot even sing from the shame. I would help them myself, but I have grown too large to enter my or exit my shell. It is very embarrassing. If you were to help my subjects and find them shells to wear, you would be rewarded handsomely. Okay. All right, now I know what to do with that shell. Come here, little bud. I gotta help you out. The little creature looks at you sad, watery eyes. Yes, I would like to give it something. I would like to give it this cool shell. It gladly accepts the shell. Ribbon! Ribbon! Thing is happy. You did good. Thank you. Take treasure. You were given an acorn. Cool. We gotta find more shells. Ooh. Me, you found two acorns. Oh my god, we're rich. I see a fish in the water. A sunny seed. Ooh, I can plant that. Hello. Obtained a rad shell. Radical, dude. Oh, okay. Another another optional way to get to the beach. So let's plant. Ground us off here. Plant something. Yes. Plant. Sunny seed. Bury the seed in the dirt and wish it luck. Hello. Yes. It gladly accepts the shell. Cricket, cricket. I think there was one more that needed one. So I need one more shell. I need to, I need to remember. I think it was up in the northern part. Yeah, it was up in the northern part. Oh, happy little thing. You can feel the sea breeze gently washing over you. Nice sound design. Hello again, tiny one. One of my subjects are still without shells to wear. They usually sit by the water. Please save them from their shame. My heart weeps for them. Okay. Actually, hold up a sec. Can I go behind you? No. He does have a tiny shell on him. Do you think they would accept the starfish as substitute? No? Okay. Um, is it in these bushes? I mean, I feel like they would be pretty obvious. Um... Let's go up and to the right. Hey, this is a secret path. Or, well, secret. 
There we go. That tree looks craggly. Hello? The ground is soft here. Plant something? No, I don't have any seeds to plant yet. Obtain the soft seed. Ooh, oh, here we go. Yes. The fuzzy exterior is pleasant. Goodbye, little friend. Hello, shiny. Hello. You feel some sort of presence here. Whatever it is, it seems that it doesn't trust you enough yet. Okay. I'll go back the way I came. Nah, I, I don't mean to intrude. I'm just here trying to trying to get my vibe on. But do, oh yeah, that's just a shortcut to that. What's your coffee doing? <laughs> I like that I walked in before him. Oh, well, hi there, stranger. Hi. Sorry, hon. I'm busy getting ready right now. Be sure to come back soon. Oh, but it's so cute, but I'll, I'll refrain. Well, actually, no, I want to, I want I can't. <laughs> yes, I do like coming in early. Hi, yes, hello. Oh my god, you have a book keeping that table steady. Delicious, freshly baked pastries crowd this counter. Maybe she wouldn't notice if you took just one. On second thought, maybe not. Yeah, no. Oh, I see a pot of coffee. Please, just, just, just pour that into my mouth. This coffee is just about ready. The aroma reminds you of pumpkins, or maybe apple strudel. Ah, oh, the scent of coffee wafting from this shelf is extremely strong. You feel more awake just being near it. Sounds like my coffee cabinet. The menu. Today's special appears to be spiced pumpkin cider. Ooh. Oh, that sounds nice. I'm sorry, little birds. I keep scaring you. All right, let's see what's down yonder. A stump. Oh no, another spot to plant a seed. Okay. Ooh. Interesting. So let's go back. We gotta go up. Up and to the left. So I can't go up on this side. I saw a little bit of, like, shoreline that would have been a viable idea. Oh, happy little chicken. Even though it's a frog. I think if I... Yep, here we go. Ooh! Thank you. 
Hey man, digging the music? Hell yeah. Man, man, music's pretty far out, right? It's like nature makes its own music, and when you play along with it, it's right on, you know? Can I just, can I just pop a squat? The strange little statue seems to react to you. I see, can see your resolve. The shrine is opened. Come north, traveler. That's nice. Ooh. Obtained a snow seed. Ooh, hello, another bug. Hello there. Yes, I can talk, even though I'm just a beetle. Say, where did you come from, anyway? Your clothes are weird. Oops, I mean, they're... I know it's kind of weird. <laughs> Maybe I should try getting myself a new outfit, even though I'm just a beetle. What do you think, stranger? Yeah. Break out of that shell, but don't uh, do it too early. Make sure you can still, like, protect yourself, bud. Ooh, that's cute. This is, this is very cozy. I like this. This is cute. I'm not great at adventure games and puzzle games a lot of the time, but I have enough game sense to help me pass by. So, this, this is nice. Congratulations on making it this far, traveler, from another land. Your searching ability is clearly excellent. Next, it is your compassion I will test. Go back out into Wabika and look for those whose hearts are ailing. Bring back proof of the compassion you have shown to these denizens. Then you may find what you are searching for. Place an item here? No, I don't have anything to place here. Welcome back. Oh, you so you missed it. Give me one second. Let me go back to... I want to show you something. Or, well, have you listen to something. I'll come back up here in a moment. Oh, he left! No! There was a musician here, and he was playing a really nice little song. I, I need to go find him. It was really nice. New inventory in stock. Guaranteed high quality or your acorns back. Wabaka General Store. Pay for it's sponsored by the Wabaka General Store. Howdy there, friend. What's up? Oh, the, the, the cat lady left. That's okay. Yes, acorns are a currency. Alright, give me one second. I'm gonna blow my nose again because apparently my nose is just like off the rockers today. going on with them. Maybe I'll have tea after this. Maybe some green tea. Yes, I am a snuffleupagus. <laughs> Care to buy something? Uh, yes. <laughs> Great! I accept any and all acorns as trade for my wares. Okay. Okay. Nice shell. Ooh, I can buy mo I can buy almost everything. We do need to catch up on our tea admin calendar. Well, let's buy the shovel. Uh, I'm going to buy this snail because I'm bad. I'm going to buy the shell. And I'm going to buy 
the watering can because I already have seeds that need to be watered. My my thin snail fences are tingling. I believe there are four items hidden around here. By the way, if you want me to stop talking, just poke me in your inventory. I'll be as quiet as a mouse who is also a mime. <laughs> oh, the seedy berry is nestled here. Water it with your watering can? Yes. Here you go, little guy. Oh, oh, wow. When you look at this flower, you hear a whisper. Lazy, humid air. Bumblebee drips seamlessly. Summer shows itself. Okay. Alright, I gotta go back up north because there is a another frog that needs a shell. I'm sorry, a freg, I think is what they're called. And they go fribbit. Yes, here you go, buddy. Here you go. Nice shell. Gladly accepts it. Yes, Frebs. Uh, Alright, let's dig up some of these little things. The ground looks cracked up here. Dig with your shovel. Yes. Dig, dig, dig. It looks just wide enough to enter. Um, sure. Enter the hole. This is my hole. Ooh. Oh! Hey, girl. You can... Oh no, she wants to climb up. She didn't want to go across the river. I'd rather chop this in some grappling hooks. Into the hole. Onto the other side of the river. Boom. 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 Hello, bird. <laughs> My snails and are tingling. Yes, there are four items here. That has not changed. Woo! Acorn. Yes. Very good. You got it. Good luck with the job. Alright, let's save the chillins. They were underneath this birch tree, she said. Dick, dick, dick. A chubby grub. <laughs> uh... Just to enter. Where does, so where does it go? My sales senses. There are two items in this area. So it's kind of like a little bit of a fast travel. Okay. So I have one of the chillins. I think she mentioned multiple. Oh, hello. Who are you? Shy mushroom. Oh, hi there. Welcome to the village, I guess. Sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. I'm just bad at talking to people you want to talk with me some more that's very nice of you please have this oh. hello again do you think we're friends that'd be nice I think we're friends. You're just shy. Well, you'll warm up a little bit. My snail senses are tingling. Yes. Um, okay, so that was fast travel there. Here's another birch tree. So this will be another chillin'. A grub a grub. Planted a seed above the village over here. Yes. Here you go, little guy. Whoop. When you look at this flower, you hear a whisper. 
A splendid palette, each tree dappled warm colors. Fall has arrived. <clears throat> Oh. Restless spirit. Oh, 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 my goodness. Can you see me? You can? Wow, this is so exciting. I haven't talked to anyone in years. How's it going? What's your favorite food? Oh, do you prefer black and green tea, sunshine, and rain? Oop, sorry, I had a lot to think about. Hi, my name is Yoki. Before I became a spirit, I used to have a lot of friends here, but it's been so long by now, I've forgotten what they look like. The only person I can remember, it was someone who wanted to open a shop someday, I think. Hey, is there any chance I could tag along with you? Maybe you could figure out who they are. I'd really appreciate that. I promise I'm very lightweight. Yeah, of course. Well, thank you so much. Let's waste no time. If you want me to tell you what I remember, just check on me in your backpack. Obtained a ghost. I've been haunted. Emblazoned on the handle is an insignia of a hawk. It's too rusty to pick up, though. It'll probably break if you even touched it. A shame. Go back down into the village. I'm gonna go give the grub mom a couple of her kids. Oh, hey, I don't remember you being here. Maybe I should try to get myself a new outfit, even though I'm just a beetle. What do you think, stranger? Uh, wasn't this the one up north? Oh well. The grubs in your backpack run inside before you. Yeet. Oh, I'm worried sick. Oh, so she's got. One, yeah, she's got three kids, so I gotta find one more. Yes, there are two items. Okay. Let's poke around a little bit real quick. Ah. The door's locked. Through the windows, you can see a lot of musical instruments. Hey man, thanks for listening to my music. It means a lot to me. It's really nice, so of course.
one item hidden. Okay. Happy little camper. Alright, boss. Out of there, my friend. Care to buy? Uh, oh, what's that? Yoki. Now there's a name I haven't heard in a while. She was one of my best friends as a kid. I remember I would pretend to run a shop selling stuff like pine cones and oak leaves. And she would always come over and pretend to buy things. Kid's silly, huh? <laughs> I really miss her. She disappeared a while back and never found out what happened. I hope wherever she is, she's doing all right. Oh, sorry. I, I, I didn't mean to talk your ear off. Have a great day, my friend. Oh, now I remember. It's Barley. Yes, we had a lot of fun together, Barley and I. I remember one time when we were young and playing store, I tried haggling down his prices. He got so mad he turned red. <laughs> I just remembered somebody else. Yeah, someone who... Someone who really liked old books. Who were they again? Codsworth. Here to buy something? Yes, bud. Great. I accept any and all acorns and all that jazz. Ooh. You know, you bought everything I had for sale and fresh out. I can't thank you enough for your patronage. Please, feel free to come here anytime, even if it's just to enjoy some tea. Ooh, I could go for some more tea. Don't mind if I do. Yes. Hmm. was a bad idea. <laughs> I'm sorry, bud. I didn't mean... No, don't be sad. Psst, you're supposed to stand in front of the counter. Okay, I made him a little... I pepped him up a little bit. I didn't, I didn't mean to make him sad with the loot. It was just cute. Flower, you hear a whisper. White, silent blanket. Creatures sleep in their warm homes. Winter shows itself. Hey, there's the other kid. What's up, Buckaroo? Dig, dig. A nubby grub. There you go, bud. This is where we started. Let's go down to the beach and let the Freb King know that the Frebs are all happy now. Oh, hey, you sound happy. My friend, I'm so sorry for my upburst from before. You are truly kind to grow flowers in this forest. As I walked around in frustration, I saw you doing so. I was so touched by this gesture that I painted you tending to one of the flowers. Please, accept it. It is the least I can do. Ooh. I would paint closer to your flowers, but my easel got caught in the sand. <laughs> huh? Are you looking for something else, my friend? That sounds very important indeed. Clearly it has inspired you. Go forth. Seize the things that make you feel passionate. This is my advice to you. Oh, okay. I, I wanted I wanted to get, get like a blown up picture of it, but that's okay. That's nice. Greetings, tiny one. I have heard of your deeds. Tiny one. No, tiny champion. 
Your noble deeds have filled me with joy. My subjects now sing with glee. Here is your reward. Please know that you will always be celebrated by Freb Kind. A golden shell. Cool. This beautiful shell is unfortunately too heavy for any Freb to wear. Maybe you can use it. Hmm? Was there something else you wanted? Ah, I haven't heard about that treasure since I was but a tadpole. I don't want to know what the size of that tadpole was, though. If I recall, the god of this land created such a thing a long time ago. Many have tried to obtain it and failed. If you wish to do so, I can only say good luck and keep a strong heart. Deuces, bud. You got it. That's worth. Oh, or, uh, oh, hello again. Ah, uh, yes, I remember Yoki very well. She used to guard the shrine. She was very dutiful. She also used to read books with me. I wish I knew what happened to her. Oh, if only I could go back. Oh my goodness, that's right, it's Codsworth. We would spend hours just poring over old books, discovering the craziest things. You know, that's how I found out about the shrine. Hang on, now I remember, there was only one other good friend of mine. I think they really liked red coffee? That sounds weird, doesn't it? Maybe I'm remembering wrong. Heading back, heading back downtown, girl. Um, I need to plant one more seed. I think I need to do it down by the musician. <laughs> Sales and strategic with two items. Oh, I found one. Surprised I haven't been done this way. Hello. Yes. When you look at this flower, you hear a whisper. Beginning anew, colors burst from frosty ground. Spring has arrived. Hey man, thanks for listening to my music. <laughs> I wanted a cup of coffee, but Jack is way too busy with all the customers that are already in there. Man, I want a cup of that smooth java. Helpful snail, I said. I believe there's one item hidden around here. Is it in the tree? It is. Yo, look at the look at these folks. Cafe owner. What? Sorry, I'm a bit busy here. Oh, you're new here, aren't you? I'm I'm sorry. How rude of me. I'd be happy to serve you, but I've just got so much work to do right now. And uh, say, you look like a capable kid. How is about you help me with serving these orders? Your pay will be worth the while. Gord's honor. Sure. Oh, wonderful. You're a real sweetheart. My name's Jackie, by the way. It's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, hon, here are the orders. A latte with extra milk goes to the pretty lady over there. The purple coat. Okay. Spice pumpkin cider goes to the older gentleman right there. Red bean goes to Leslie, the one in the cute bat shirt. Got all that? You got it. Old man. Oh. Oh. oh uh. 
Uh, oh, hello there, dear. Is that my drink you out there? Yes. So he was... Spiced. <laughs> Thank you, dearie. You know, your outfit, it reminds me of the clothing people wore in a country I saw when I was young. Yes, that was a long time ago. Oh, oh, oh. Back when I used to travel, I visited a place far to the west. It was very beautiful. You should have seen it. But these days, I hear it's destitute. I'm not sure what happened. It's a real pity. Either way, sorry to bored you with this old man's ramblings. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Um, before I get him confused. Here you go, lady. It's a book. It's a book on theories about raising the dead. Oh, how droll. Hey, man, you got my drink? Yes. You get the red bean. Thanks, little guy. Sorry, did you need something? Yoki. You? Who are you, exactly? Yoki. Yeah, I knew her. Very well. One day, in fact. I remember seeing some person in armor wearing a cape, walking toward that shrine that she was always around. thought it was weird, but I wanted to give her privacy, so I left them alone. That was a mistake. Nobody ever saw that warrior Yoki again. Disappeared to time. Could have stopped it. Huh. To be honest, feels good to get that off my chest. I've been holding that in for a while. Thanks, little guy. You're a good listener, and a good waiter, too. Listen. That's right. I remember everything that happened, and... I miss them all. Very much. But at least my memories of good times have returned. I think with that, I finally feel at ease. Thank you so much, stranger. It's not much, but here, take this. Handed an old plush doll. That thing you're searching for, if you're as good of a person as I think you are, you'll find it. I can only hope it meets your expectations. It's time for me to go to the cami. Best of luck to you, stranger. We <laughs> yeet. Hello, lady. And so I... Oh, do you have my drink? I do. Thanks. Anyhow, as I was saying, I touching that statue in the garden and I heard a spooky voice. Whoa, really? Really? No lie. Told me something about a traveler from another land being here. Whoa, cool, cool. Mm-hmm, I thought so too. I wonder what they came here for. I don't know, I don't know. Everybody should be happy. Oh. Well, call me a squash and serve me for dinner. You did it. I would hope so. Here's the payment for a job well done, huh? Hope you enjoy it. I made it just for you. Oh. Yo. Cake. <laughs> Have a fabulous day, hon. What's that? You're looking for something else? Sorry, I don't think I've ever heard of something like that. All I know is one good turn deserves another. You get what I mean, hon? Thanks again for your help, hon. You're a real lifesaver. Now I can relax and get back to running the cafe smoothly. And look at that beautiful painting we got. My uh, friend painted it, you know. Uh-huh. <laughs> Serving skills, you should work here full-time. Excuse the help. <laughs> Thanks for the drink, little guy. Probably to herself. She's really cute. <laughs> Pretend you didn't hear anything. <laughs> Thanks again for the drink. It's fantastic. Jackie always makes just how I want it. You know it. <laughs> you know it, hun. Not, not sure how she can taste the coffee with all that milk, though. Like, hey, don't make fun of her cheese. Oops. <laughs> didn't mean to offend. Goopy. Man, I sure do wish I could have a cup of delectable coffee. Huh? What's that? You helped out Jackie and now she's free? I have a confession to make. I don't actually like drinking coffee. I just thought I'd sound cool if I complained a lot. Mm. Well, either way, thanks for letting me know. You're something for being a good kid. 
were given an acorn. I'll thank you, bud. Oh, you're... What are you doing back here? All right. <laughs> the sound of grubs snoring softly. Oh, look at that. Everybody's all cozied and tidied up. A knitted sweater. Hey, look at me. Good as new, huh? The tailor fixed me right up. Weren't you the one who brought her back her kids? Good for you. Here, maybe this will help you get ahead, too. Don't spend it all in one place. Or do. I'm not your boss. to the bathroom, so I'll be right back.
Okay. All right. Let's get back to it. Mm -hmm. So I think I've helped everybody out. Ooh. Everybody's awake. Culinary spot. Oh, welcome, stranger. I'm so sorry this place is such a mess. Those little rap scallions, you know. Either way, please make yourself a home. This dude should be done before too long. By the way, are you related to the tall gentleman who's staying with us? Your clothes look awfully similar. Hello, bud. What's up? The people here, and they're very hospitable. They're certainly much better here than the West. Much kinder. Yet I can't help but feel a certain guilt. Perhaps I should return home and try to take care of those I knew the best I can. No oh, man, I'm so hungry. So hungry. So the, you saw a ghost too. Oh, ghost is okay. Um, I don't know. Out of there, my friend. Still don't have anything in stock. <laughs> That's okay, bud. Yeah, I don't think I have any more seeds. Okay. the hole? Yes. Ooh. Which person among these was a childhood friend of the ghost you helped? If you think Freb King was a friend of hers, go west. Do you think the cafe owner was a friend of hers, go east. If you think the shopkeeper was the friend, go north. Which of these is not a child of Grub Mother? If you think that Chubby Grub is not, go west. Lubby Grub, go east. Grubby Grub, go north. What is the name of the small green creatures who now fill this forest with song? Frebs west, Krogs east, Snibbits north. And what inspires the artist you helped out? Pretty seashells west, tall flowers east, delicious beverages north. Are you ready? If so, continue forward. If not, turn back. 
my snail senses are tingling. There's one hidden enemy. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Snail. I'm gonna need you to relax for a little bit. A seed of hope. Congratulations, traveler. You have reached the end of my trials and proven yourselves thoroughly. What will you do now? Will you remain in Wabeka or return to your home and use what you found? Whatever the case, you are welcome to stay here whenever you like. I thank you sincerely for all that you have done. What, can I say any more to him? Or... If you'd like to leave w Wabaka now, that is fine. You have already done plenty. But troubles still lurk here. If you'd like a hint about them, you may speak to the statue at the back of the shrine. I think he means like the literal back of the shrine, like... Oh, hello. Hey, you'll never believe it. I found out how to get up around the cliff. There's a path just... Oh. You're, if you're up here, then you already know about it, right? Dang. Sorry, fam. Let's turn this snail back on. Little tower. Oh man, this is confusing. <laughs> Yikes. It's dead silent too, so it's like it's a little, a little, a little awkward. Here, let's try to get up to the upper right. Okay. Hey, there we go. Oop. Hello. Ragged warrior. It has been many years. Many years since I have been visited by another living being. Traveler, you no doubt 
Seek what I once did, tempter the shrine's inner depths and claim its reward. Do not make the mistake I did. I came seeking the treasure at any cost. I was violent, mindless. And so I've been trapped here as penance for my crimes. However, even now, as I stand here in your presence, I can tell your intentions are good. Here, take my last possession, my beloved and war-torn shield. Perhaps you can make better use of it than I. Traveler, you have truly gone above and beyond. Did you really come here just to obtain the seed of hope? Or was it because you want to help those who are suffering? To me, it seems this is your true intention. Either way, while there are no more treasures tucked away in this land, I hope you will come back someday. The writing from before has disappeared. Now all that is written is, rest in peace. Other bits and bobs. And there's Bynum. Tyler, so him. That's cute. So there, and this is not the end of it. There is a little bit of an expansion that comes along with the with the game now as well. The mystery of the frost. Oop, mailbag. Venture, I hope your travels farewell. Your kindness to Prebkind shall never be forgotten. Please visit soon so we can sing together into the night. Hello, I just went to go put flowers on Yoki's grave and thought of you. You can come and read any books I have, if you want to, I mean. No pressure or anything, but it would be nice. Hello, my child. My darlings have grown much, and they are so excited to see you. Please come visit us in the springtime. Another piece for you, mon ami. Hey, hon. Miss you lots. <laughs> you little sad faces in there. You'll come visit soon, won't you? There's a lot a hot cup of coffee here with your name on it. That's sweet. Hope all is well. It's strange. Winter's lasted way too long here in Wabaka. Oop, I skipped. Whee! Salutations. I hope this missive finds you in excellent health. Thanks to your cordial assistance, I was able to observe the singularly P 
dispute delightful singing patterns of the common Freb. Their sultry tones are beyond compare. Yours truly, Freb Enthusiast. Now, dear adventurer, the winters lasted way too long. Or, I'm sorry. Hope all is well. It's strange. Winters lasted way too long here in Wabaka. It worries me. Are things the same where you are? Your friend, Farley. Here we are. Back in Wabaka. Completely silent. Ancient shield. Kind of like a new game plus. It saved all the previous progress. Grove of Solace. Village to the east. Cove to the south. Spring to the north. General store just ahead. Ooh. Chunk of ice seems fragile. So maybe go to the north of the spring. If it's a natural hot spring, then it, you know, it'll be warm no matter what. Healthy but lonely. Oh. <laughs> Since it's a one item. You got it, fam. Shrine is closed. Ooh. It's slippery. Where is everyone? Imagine you're they might all be huddled in their homes trying to stay warm. Eh, he got his easel unstuck. Statue. Oh, the poor statue. No singing, no more. What point? Bro. See, he doesn't seem to be moving at all. I guess they wanted to make some kind of barrier. That's understandable. Unless this is like literally like a glacier. Oh, I see the coin up there. An odd shard. All right, I'm gonna go back to the village because I, I I can obviously access them. I just I don't need to. <laughs> Secrets break too much. Maybe this is just representing, like, uh, fragile ice? No, I think this is just, like, these are ice mounds or something. As in, please acknowledge the barriers. Can I slide down the, the waterfall? 
Uh, what's up, Barley? How you doing, bud? Let's go say hi. Oh, the flower is still here. Poor bud. Hey, you! You came back! Welcome, my friend! Hey, if it isn't the delightful person who assisted me in my cranial plight. I don't understand it. There has to be some way to end this winter. There just has to. Strange, ain't it? This weather. Guess we're getting the cold shoulder. <laughs> Your horrible puns are pretty big concentration. Oops, I'll shut up. Good to see you. How have you been? Did you get my letter? Ah, is that so? I hope that thing you found is helping you out. Listen, it hasn't been great here lately. This winter has lasted abnormally long, and it hasn't shown any signs of stopping. We can't grow anything. People are... Oh, that's right. I hate to ask, but could you please do me a favor? It's about Cosworth. He went up to his store a while back to investigate this bizarre weather to see if it can be stopped, you know? He's not so great at taking care of himself, so... I was hoping you could bring him this. I'll compensate you any way I can. You're a true friend. Boy, it's bitterly cold out there. I'm still worried about Cosworth. I could be keeping him. I hope the path from here didn't get blocked off, but I'm pretty sure he knows the back path. Warm green tea fills this brave little kettle. Wood cracks in the iron stove. It's the only thing keeping this place warm. I'm racking my brain. Maybe a really big candle? Hmm. You might need a really big candle, miss. Ah, oh, a solitary loaf. It's a loaf of bread left. Somehow, you can tell that it's stale. That's such a shame. Fresh bread is wonderful. Alright, Codsworth. We gotta help you out, bud. Door shut. Oh, geez. It's frozen solid. Awful. I shut. Reads. Gone south. Owner. See all when it gets warmer. Loved grandmother. Here's to be a snowy depiction of you. Oh. Looks like it's been sitting here for a while. So even the snowman has like ice on him. Jackie. Oh, it's you! Why, you've picked an awfully strange time to return, but welcome all the same. I hope... Oh, I hope you've come with another delicious cider. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. How are you, hon? It must have been better cold coming all the way here. Well, stay as long as you like and warm up. So you're, uh, you're way here. You didn't see happen to see Archibald, did you, my friend? The artist you helped out earlier? He went a while back to look for supplies, and I haven't seen him since. Sure, he's, I sure hope he's doing okay. I'd look for myself, but I need to keep this place warm and food available for all the people stuck here. Speaking of which, here, have a hot cocoa on the house. Hot cocoa. Cool it down before long. And please let me know if you see him, okay, hon? Ooh. Man, it sure is cold outside. I hate it when it's cold. You can't smell anything and your fingers get all numb. Man, what a pain. Sadly, the dog is not in the mood to be pet. You respect its wishes. Aw, oh, man. It sure is a bummer right now, huh? Brr. This cold isn't good for these old bones. Hey, young one, have you seen Leslie around? 
I've seen various people come and go, but she seems to have left and not come back. I do worry about that girl. Whoa, it's you! Hello, everyone. Ooh, do, would you like this? It's very cold. It's lucky that I have friends with warm houses. <laughs> oh, I remember you. You worked at Jackie's Cafe for a little while, right? Why did you decide to come back now, of all times? Yeah, that's weird, since it's so cold. Well, not as long as I have you, it isn't. <laughs> hey, hi! Wanna have a solo play? The letter? The letter. Bernice? Hope all is well. You received this letter. My kids are on their way to your place. I'm well and truly sorry for imposing on you. They'll be good, I promise. I just can't bear to have them here any longer with this infernal snow. I need to stay here to take care of the people who can't leave. I hope you understand. Love, Bernard. Ah, hello. Welcome, welcome. Please stay as long as you like. My home is your home. Say, please tell me. Is what's happening here also happening further west? The snow, I mean? I don't know. Why, why, why do I get to have this choice? Um... What will I do? What's wrong, Dad? Oh, nothing, nothing. We're just talking about boring grown-up stuff. I saw somebody weird going up north. Nobody believed me, but I saw. Coco's gone ice cold. That's a shame. I'll figure out who it goes to. No, the flower. That's so cute. I'm trying to figure out I'm trying to remember the back way into the into there. I think if you go up the hill in the village somehow that you could get up there. That's just a shortcut. That little path right there. All oh, right, if I go around and come up this side of the river, I should be able to go up there. Oh, right. Um, I can't climb waterfalls. Let's, over, let's go check on the ghost spot over here. Chunk of ice seems fragile. Well, I don't have a like pickaxe or anything, so won't be breaking that anytime soon. A 
Hello, friend. Uh, that's worth. Uh, so hungry. Give them something? Yes. Oh, food. Nom 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 nom. Thank you so much. I hope I didn't scare you. I just forgot to eat. I wanted to see if we could end this winter. Mount Sabi to the north holds the secret. I'm sure of it. Try reading the books for more. The book reads as follows. Mount Sabi sits on an island north of Wabaka. Said to be where the kami originated from, the mountain is perpetually coated in frost. Those who climb it must have enough energy to crest its steep, slippery slopes. If you can, visit the delightful hot spring near the base. Though powerful, the kami has their flaws. They must sleep during the winter to restore their power. The shrine is not open to visitors during the winter as a result. Completely silent. All the books are in disarray. The book reads as follows. The flame of will is the burning soul of Wabaka. It flickering, its flickering spark is what controls the flow of time. The strange little statue doesn't sing when you touch it. Oh, I missed this before. Bruh. All the books from Disarray. Okay, so I have to go up north. Legend of the Spooky? Hmm? No. It's just a cute little game. Nothing spooky about it. is written here, but it's in a language you don't understand. Science says hot spring in weathered text. Urgh, this water is freezing. Ugh. Stay out of that then. Relax, Sil. I had the starting soon at the beginning of the stream and that was it. Totally frozen shut. You can't get it. Something is written here, but it's in a language you don't understand. Okay, so I need I need some tools to get up here. So let's see if our good buddy Barley has anything I can buy or use. Of 
course. Why would I, why would I have a cozy friendly game in my title and then actually have like a bait and switch? Like if you do, hey, just look at this art style. Like how can this be spooky? Uh, welcome back, friend. I hope you're well. And a news Cosworth. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure he needs the rest. Now that he's full up, he'll be fine to make the trek back here once he awakens. You're an invaluable ally. How can I repay you? Well, how about this? A trusty old hammer. I've seen unnaturally thick eyes crop up all over the place. This should help you out. Looks like I'll have to go back out soon and chop some more wood for the stove. Keep the people safe. I'll have to keep trying my best. Just seeing you here has re-energized me at least. No. That is a plot twist. If there is, then it'll get me. Whoa. I mean, yeah, I get that, but no, this game, I, I know that this game is not going to pull anything like that. At least not to, like, a severe degree. It might pull off some, like, oh, but that's it. Take that. Two books are buried in the snow. They're mostly ruined, but you can faintly make out their covers. On... Um, Theory of reason. Huh. That's fair. No, this game doesn't... It, this game has a little bit of ambience. I mean, this this iteration, i.e. the Mystery of Frost, which is just the little expansion to it, is... It's definitely had been a lot quieter, whereas the other one had a lot more ambience. Hello. As beetles, we huddle together for warmth. Why are you out here by yourself in the cold, traveler? As beetles, we hope this frost ends soon. Oh, yeah, I know. Blade, yeah, that makes sense for Blade Runner. Oh, this is just a little, a little adventure game about helping out people... And being friends. Nothing too crazy. Or there are all eldritch entities. Clearly. And I'm just the unwitting pawn. Right? So man, it seems oddly familiar. Give it something. What can I give it? Um... Oh, I know. It is very quiet. It's literally just the footsteps and wind. But I mean, it's. I guess it's tra also trying to represent the uh, dead of winter. Because that's the current situation. Um, but I think I know what I need to do for this little piece. If I can get Jackie to heat up the hot cup of cocoa, I can give that snowman the cocoa. I think. Sanj. Oh, 
Oh, hi there, hon. Be sure to warm yourself. Can you heat this up for me, please? <laughs> you need to co co heat it up? Don't worry about it, hon. You got the hot cocoa. Careful. Cool down before long. All right, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. I gotta deliver it. Here you go, mister. <laughs> um, hurry! Oh, ah, it is you who gave me this elixir of life, I assume? Wonderful, marvelous, your kindness knows no bounds. You always seem to show up in time, hmm? I will finish my drink, then be over to the cafe. Oh, and if you get there first, please let Jackie know I'm okay. I would hate to make her worry. Uh, yeah, I'm going right there. I'm gonna let her know that her homie is Wormy. Oh, look at that. Hello, you wonderful thing, you. Come on over here, won't you? Look at that. Archibald told me all about what you did. Oh, you are just the sweetest, you know that, hun? Oh, we do without you. Here, have my strongest espresso on the house. Just a little sip and you'll have more zip than you'll know what to do with. You want to use it? Just select it from your backpack, okay, hun? Oh, he's playing his music again. Espresso out of it? Hell yeah, dude. Hey man, seeing those two together again, it inspired me, you know? Hope these tunes keep you warm. You're not sure how you can tell, but it seems overjoyed to see you again. Pet it? Yes. Weh, weh. Without a doubt, this is a good dog. She's always been a bit of a quiet girl, that, er, you've always been a bit of a quiet girl, that Leslie. Never know what's going on in her head. Not that there's much going on in mine. Oh, man, I really hate the cold. It's starting to get me worried. What if it like stays like this forever? Man. You're not sure how, but it seems overjoyed to see you again. Yes. Wet butt. Just for real, Rob. Alright, so now we have the hammer. I helped out the couple of villagers. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I do you have a confession? Bro, how could you do that? Did 
just one roll. It's not Kumo sushi roll. So sad. Man, this espresso is really strong if it gives me that much energy in such a short burst. So, Stan Lake, right around here. Ooh, hello. A weird shard. I got two of those now. Is written on here, but it's in a language you don't understand. It's a bit tall for my. Yeah, a little too tall for my boost. There's items here. see a book over there. I like it. He hold he holds a little chest because because the coffee is just so damn strong. It's just like, whoo, whoo, oh, jeez. Catch a breath. Two images must become one. Looks about right. Oh, well, the door is open, so. <laughs> um. Obtained a key. I'm gonna go back down because I saw another key back down there. Um. You're a cute little snail, but I'll have you hush up for the moment. Door is locked tight. Open it with your key. Yes. The key broke in the lock. Oh, that's a shame. Okay. Interesting. All right, let's check out this door. back 
back up the other way if this looks like it. If uh, this will probably be like, you need another key. Or maybe it's just an alternative area. What does the text say? Form a line to choose the way. Oh, I think I know. Something moved. Yep. So, but then that means, since I can't get back, if I go outside, there might be a little drop down. Each floor has an exterior entrance. Looks like something is hidden inside the wall. Hit it with your hammer? Yes. Find a strange shard. Consider the exterior and interior alike. Okay. So now I'm like way above. Okay. So then if I go back down. they'll save the princess or uh the seasons or something well i mean the, right now the forest of wabaka is trapped in eternal frost at the moment so we're trying to figure that out and be like hey could you like warm up a little bit power over time. Through it, seasons change. It brings life and death in equal measure. Yes, 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 I see the person up there. The flame of will can bring time forward, but nothing can bring it back. If the flame were to be extinguished, nothing would progress ever again. Hello, I'm gonna have to ask you to put the flame back. I need, I just need a little more time. If I can just get this flame to do what I want, I can go back. Convince them to give you the flame? Uh, yes. It won't work? How do you know that? You're just making that up, right? What? What have I been doing then? I just wanted, I just wanted. Yoki. She wouldn't have wanted this, would she? What am I doing? Here, take this. Put it back where it belongs. Ooh. Look at that warm. The flame gives off a warm, soothing heat.
The icy path leads to the bottom. Wind flowing through the holes of the statue seem to be producing the beautiful melody. It is. Ah, yes. Excellent. It seems to be serenely enjoying its time. It gently welcomes you to the sauna. Oh, wonderful. Traveler. I have just awake I have just awakened from what feels like a very long sleep. Will you tell me what has happened? Yes. Hmm. I suppose I should have foreseen this happening one day. I could sense that her heart was full of frustration. It is difficult to cope with loss. But perhaps this was for the best. You taught her better than I could have. Do not worry. She will not be punished. She acted foolishly, but her intentions were good. Thank you, once again, Traveler, for all that you've done. Hey, guess what? I think I know what's causing this winter. Right up ahead is a mountain called Mount Sabi. At the top, there's... Uh-oh. If you're coming down from the mountain, and the water's not frozen anymore, and then you solved the issue already, right? Shoot. Well, anyway, if you want to get back to the mainland, you can feel free to take my canoe. I want to explore this place. I'll try to return it before I'm done. That is a big fish. Big. Guys, what I did it was... It was so stupid. I put everyone in danger. Barley, Godsworth, I'm sorry. I'm really, really sorry. Ah, oh, Leslie, you're right. 
you know, that's punishment. You'll have to spend more time with us. God damn it. Wait, what? Where are your friends? If you're feeling sad or alone, you should come to us. Yeah, Leslie, we're sorry too. I just get so caught up in my books I sometimes forget to check up on my friends. We could have done a better job of noticing your feelings. Uh, I, I just didn't want to come and trouble you guys with my pain. I didn't want to drag you down with me. Yoga was a very special person. I know how much it hurts having her gone. And I wish there was something we could do to have her with us. But there isn't anything. There's no words of wisdom or magical artifact. All we can do is just come to terms with what things are. And be thankful that we at least have one another. Hey, uh, could I have a hug? Yes, of course. Group hug! Later on. Ah, wonderful. Been to a party forever. Oh, thanks and all that. <laughs> this is my first ever party. Am I doing it right? Should I dance? Hmm. Oh, don't worry about him. He just gets a little nervous when he's in a room with lots of people. Me. Leslie told us what you did at the mountain. And as always, I'm both grateful and baffled by your kindness. Hope you enjoy this little party. Uh, hey, uh, how's it going? Yeah, this is awkward. Sorry, I really went kind of crazy back there, didn't I? Thanks for snapping me out of it. If you ever want to hang out with us, just let me know, okay, little guy? Hello, Tiny Champion. It is I, Breb King. I am unable to attend your joyous celebration in person, so I had my Frebs construct a remote speaking device. By the way, come speak to me when the party is over. I have a gift for you. Please, don't be humble. I insist. Chubby Grub! This grub is iron. Come really. <laughs> Go on, huh? Try the cake. I made it just for you. I love that they they had to kick all the tables together just to do this. And it even still has the table with a book underneath one of the feet. Oh, ho a toast. A toast to our good friend and savior. Can't have a walk. No. Hey, man. Figured some celebratory tunes were in order. Enjoy, dude. This cake is bigger than you are. Try a little. Oh, hell yeah. Light, fluffy, and flavored with both cocoa and vanilla. This surely is the king of cakes. Did you like the cake? Sure looks like you did. You scarfed it right up. Thanks for everything you've done, hon. You'll never know how much we appreciate it.
Bye. See you soon. Have a wonderful night. The next day. Oh, we we shacked up with the grub mom's house. And hey, it's very squat. You find its shape oddly amusing. Whoa, this one is lively. And hey, it looks peaceful. You decide to walk carefully so as not to disturb it. A basket of balls of silk. You wonder idly where it came from, then decide it might be better to leave some stones unturned. You hear the sound of grubs snoring softly. Oh, hello, Grub Mom. Never Grub. Thanks you for digging us up. Chubby Grub. Num num num. The scrub is contentedly chewing on a root. Wee. The scrub is enjoying playing in the dirt. Oh, good morning, traveler. I hope you slept well. Ah, uh, that's right. Did you get my letter? Sorry about the bite mark. Chubby is a peckish little child. Say hi to the kids, won't you? They won't stop talking about you the whole you were while the whole time we were away. Okay. Ho oh, ho welcome venturer extraordinaire. Ah oh. Yeah dude, enjoy that donut. Arr, I'm glad it's warmed up again. I can't do much when it's cold. If that went any longer, I'd have turned into a popsicle. <laughs> Letha told me that you climbed up that mountain all by yourself. You poor thing. Hope my special espress espresso kept you warm and energized. Oh, big time. Hmm. I feel like... Things are changing, and I'm changing too. I have more confidence now. When I grow up, I want to be just like you. Is very cute. Hey there, old buddy. How's hanging? I think I'm gonna head on over to Jackie soon and grab a cup of Joe. Help clear my head, you know. Get it? Is very good vibe. Oh, give me that. When you look at this flower, you hear a whisper. Beginning anew, colors burst from frosty ground, spring has arrived. Hey man, I thought about it some more, about leaving, you know? But I like it here, so I think I'll stick around. You know, even though, even though, as a beetle, I'm full of the most wisdom, I have to admit, you seem quite wise too. Perhaps one day you can teach me something. Well, hello there, my friend. Here for some tea or just a chat? Oh, hey, yeah. Uh... Ah, hello again. No, no, we're not cold. This is just comfy, is all. <laughs> yes. Phew. I'm so glad it's warmed up again. It's business as usual now. Little shopkeeper humor for you there. 
Say, you see that lady over there, sharing her purple coat? She and I had an adventure, a long time ago, far away from here, back when I was just a kid. We were all alone at night. It was some scary stuff. You really should have seen it. Ah, memories. Ah, yes, that was quite the horrific experience. You were very brave. I thought I was done for. Ah, it was nothing. Oh. I was hoping for more. What's up there? Here to do some shopping? Yo, Barley, what should I buy if I'm thinking of going traveling? Uh, let's see, boots, backpack, maybe mask. Basically, everything our adventure friend here is wearing. Well, oh, hang on, that's a mask? I totally thought that was their face. Now I'm not sure, but I feel like at this point it would be rude to ask. It's a little plague doctor mask. Like, come on. Mm hmm. Where should I go, though? Maybe I can find a place that's nice and dark? Is it? Cool. Fresh goods. Freshly baked bread. Ooh, it smells really tasty. I do have one seed left, though, that I want to plant. Oh, I can't. Oh, friend. I see you saved Wabaka from that accursed winter. Most commendable. Suppose you're surprised to see me out and about? Do not fear. I did not escape. I have atoned enough, and now I am free. It is time I left, and see the world in a different light than before. The most important thing I learned while meditating? It's impossible to go backward through time. We can only learn from our past, then look forward. I shall go and do as you've done. That is the right path for me now. Yeah, it's really cute.
returned to my kingdom, to me it was beautiful, has become more beautiful. But I believe this is just because I can now appreciate it. Is this not, is this world not amazing, warrior? Venture, sup? I was wondering, what do you do from here on out? Have any plans? Well, whatever happens, you better do as much for yourself as you've done for us, okay? Treat yourself right and you deserve it. That's cute. That'll be it for me today. I just wanted to do something nice and cozy. Um, next time will likely be RimWorld, just for you, Rura. I need to mod it and get the DLC sorted out. What? Oh, next, yes, next time is Divinity on Friday. That is true. Even if it is Christmas, Divinity will still be a thing. But next, I'm talking about next time for my normal Tuesday. But, alright. Have a good rest of your afternoon or evening or wherever. And have a happy holidays. Bye-bye.